And this paper is about defining the cellular target for potential treatment of aging as a disease. Uh, till recently, aging uh, has been seen as a like law of nature, which hits everybody. And only recently, uh, several revolutionary uh, changes uh, kind of occurring um, due to the number of very interesting discoveries uh, which were made in the field, which allowed us to define specific cells which are, exist in a very limited numbers when we are young and which accumulate with age and with the products of their secretion, poison our organism, turning it into chronically inflamed state which is the hallmark of aged mammal. Uh, the finding which we published recently allowed us to uh, redefine the nature of cells which are sources of poisonous inflammation associated with aging. These cells appeared to be not senescent cells or at least not entirely senescent cells. It's not only senescent cells. These cells are actually part of our natural immune system uh, belonging to the category of macrophages, cells capable of phagocytosis, the most ancient component of our immunity. These are not all macrophages, but macrophages which become changed with age and which acquire several traits which they can be distinguished from other macrophages as, and defined. This is very important finding because it allowed us to specify the enemy and to be much more precise in aiming towards our uh, ultimate target. So our name of the game today is not only to find and kill senescent cells, but more to find the pharmacological approaches to eradication of this subvariant of macrophages, which we named SAMs, for senescent associated macrophages.